grilled steak with garlic shallot puree and avocado. Roasting the shallot and garlic imparts a rich, deep flavor, but you could cut about 20 minutes off your cooking time by sautéing instead of roasting. First mince the shallot and garlic. Heat a large skillet over medium-high heat. Add 1 tablespoon cooking fat and swirl to coat the bottom of the pan. Add the shallot and cook until translucent, 2 to 3 minutes, then add the garlic and cook until aromatic, about 1 minute. Puree in the blender as directed. Serves 2. Prep time, 15 minutes. Cook time, 25 minutes. Total time, 40 minutes. Ingredients. 2 steaks, 5 ounces each, for grilling, sirloin, strip, ribeye, tenderloin. 1 teaspoon salt. 1 teaspoon black pepper. 2 cloves garlic, peeled. 1 shallot, peeled. 2 tablespoons extra virgin olive oil. 1 avocado, split lengthwise, pitted, and peeled. Directions. Remove the steaks from the refrigerator 30 minutes before cooking. Preheat a grill to high heat, 500 degrees Fahrenheit, and the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Line a baking sheet with foil. Mix the salt and pepper in a small bowl and use two-thirds of the mixture to season the steaks. Toss the garlic and shallot in one tablespoon of the olive oil and arrange on the prepared baking sheet. Season evenly with the remaining salt and pepper. Roast in the oven for 25 minutes, until the cloves are soft throughout. Transfer the garlic and shallots to a food processor. Add the remaining one tablespoon olive oil and puree. Transfer the puree to a dish, cover with foil to keep warm, and set aside. Lay the steaks on the hot grill and sear for 2-3 to three minutes. The steaks should pull off easily when they are seared. Turn the steaks over and sear the other side. The second side doesn't take as long, 1-2 to two minutes, or to desired doneness. Let the steaks rest for 5-10 to ten minutes. Meanwhile, Sear the avocado halves pitted side down on the grill until lightly browned, 3 to 4 minutes. Arrange the avocado and steaks on plates and top the steaks with the warm garlic and shallot puree. Make it a meal, this flavorful steak goes great with the roasted beet, orange, and avocado salad or green bins with sautéed onion, mushrooms, and peppers. Grilling Steak Grilling room temperature steak keeps the outside from overcooking while waiting for the cold inside to reach the right temperature. And don't just tuck right into that gorgeous steak when you pull it off the grill let it rest. If you cut into your steak fresh off the grill, or out of the pan, all those juices, and flavor, will spill out onto your plate, making your meat both drier and less tasty. Letting it rest allows the steak to cool slightly causing the muscle fibers to relax and retain all those delicious juices in the meat. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, and share.